her name? Sasa. Sasa? Yeah. Oh, nice name. Very adorable. The boy or girl? A girl. Huh? A girl. Oh, she, is bo the baby is boy or girl? Girl. A oh, girl. Huh. <laughs> Just talking about homeschool something. <laughs> No. You have to ask me a question. Yeah, I just, I just, yeah, very nice, really right? Yeah, that's really cool. It's really nice. nice. Yeah. Very, very, I just Smooth. bought it. Yeah. yeah it's, it's a very, very nice. action yeah. camera. Yeah. Very nice, right? Oh. What's your name? Nicole. Nicole? Yeah. <laughs> Daniel. Hi. Yeah. Do you know the Lori? Lori Macabon? I don't think so. Oh, uh, so, um, do you know the um, Roswell, Mrs. Roswell? Lindsay Roswell. Lindsay Laswell. Yeah. Yeah. Our teacher. Yeah, I know. We her. are very close. Oh. Yeah. Cool. That's nice. Yeah, she's really fun. She's. She's. She's great. Yeah. She's she great. Is. Yeah. <laughs> um, I just curious about the homeschool, the Christian homeschool. You, you, you yourself make up the uh, uh, curriculum. Yeah. Like this. Well, yeah, we go and we find the curriculum. Um, according to how our children learn um, and what type of curriculum that we need and then um, we go through a charter school so our charter school will make sure that what they're learning is what they should be learning for the charter school이 뭐냐면요 일종의 자유령 공립학교인데요 국가 교육 예산으로 모든 예산이 지원되지만 공립학교처럼 일체의 규정이나 커리큘럼 통제를 받지 않고요 학교 단위로서의 책임을 가지고 운영되는 자유령 학교라고 말할수 있습니다. 5년마다 책임 경영을 통해서 평가를 받게 되는데 그때 존폐 위기를 결정하게 된다고 합니다. Which charter school? Connecting Waters. Oh, Connecting yeah, Waters. It's really, it's really popular. Okay. Yeah, and so they just make sure that my kids are learning what they need to learn, but I can choose any type of curriculum that I want. Mm -hmm. So since they're in kindergarten and second grade, I kind of I look at what they need to know and then I have some curriculum we don't sit down and do school all day mm -hmm. I say like okay they need to learn how to add two numbers so like mm -hmm. we'll go to the park and we'll pick up some bark mm -hmm. be like okay count how many pieces you have in your hand you have 10 mm -hmm. okay what if I take five away how many do you have now right like um, I'll take the concepts from the curriculum mm -hmm. but then I will do them my own way mm -hmm. to make it fun for the kids because mm -hmm. I want them to learn Mm. I want them to love learning. Daddy, mm. water. I don't have a water. On the car. No, we on the car is over there, way over there, oh. very far. So, okay. sorry. <laughs> My fault. <laughs> so how do you, how do you teach the uh, Jesus Christ to the kids? Um, well, through different ways. I mean, we pray every day, and then they all have their Bibles. Um, sometimes we'll go through like a little devotional for kids. Um, there's this book called Indescribable, which we really like, and it it will say something about like science and how like it relates to God, mm -hmm. and it will give you some scripture to look at. Mm -hmm. Um, and then they go to Awanas um, every week. Which is a Awanas. Awana. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Um, and so, so in Ripon Grace. Yeah. yeah, I know that. Yeah. So they yeah. love that. So it gives us an automatic story. Right, to right. To like read through and then verses to memorize. Memorize verses. Yeah, yeah. it's awesome. And they love it. So Awana is worldwide. No. Mm -hmm. Yes, there are a lot of uh, a lot of churches in Korea. They oh, doing that wow. Awana. The spark or something right there. <laughs> oh yeah, Awana. So when when you try to devotion or um, pray, they obey well? Oh yeah. Really? They, they love they ask to read their Bibles all oh, really? the time by themselves. Okay. Even though the two little ones can't read. <laughs> they just sit there and they just love looking at their Bible and okay. um, but like we always talk about you know like how like what God is doing in our lives mm -hmm. and like what he's blessed us with mm -hmm. and how to be thankful and just like the different characteristics that he has um just throughout our day i just 
comes up in conversation. They ask lots of questions about oh. you know, heaven or like right, right, right. Just about God and stuff. So it opens up conversation. Do you so feel any burden uh, when you got the, uh, difficult answers, difficult questions? Oh yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, no, yes. I, definitely, I send them to my husband. You're frankly <laughs> speaking, I don't know. No, well, no, I yeah. send them to my husband. I say, go talk to your dad. Okay. No, but um, yeah, sometimes uh, we'll say, like, you know what? I don't know. That's a really good question. And we'll look it up or, you know, we'll ask a pastor or mm -hmm. somebody that might know. Your husband is a pastor? Or? Pardon? Your pa uh, husband is a pastor? My husband's not a pastor. But, like, you know, there's lots of pastors that we could talk to, like okay. at our church or whoever it is that might know. More than us, or how to describe it to a child. Mm -hmm. um, Do not say it to a side mm -hmm. <laughs> But yeah, we just talk about what we know and what we can answer, and mm -hmm. if we can't, we research it and figure out a way mm -hmm. to answer it for them. Mm -hmm. I think that's the biggest thing. We t part of homeschooling, I think, is I take their questions that they ask, like you know, why are the leaves green, or you know, whatever the question may be. Uh, how right. is paper made? Uh, right. So we'll actually yeah. go. Google. Uh -huh. Mom, I did uh -huh. you see um, uh. the try me? Yeah, I do. Just a minute. Um, so we'll go on YouTube and Mom. you can look up any Mom. video of how Mommy. dolls are made, how Mom. paper is mm. made. Yeah. Nico, what, what is the most difficult thing in homeschooling? Uh, I think trusting myself. Uh, trusting yourself. Mm -hmm. okay. Because homeschool is not school how you think about it like sitting down in the classroom working all day mm -hmm. homeschool is not that right um, so it's really hard some people try to homeschool like that and then they get frustrated and like, right 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 hating it right right um so the hardest part is trusting myself like going to the park and picking up bark and counting it and sorting it out like it doesn't feel like enough it feels oh. too easy yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Are you sure, like this is right, this right. is it. Like in, inside yourself. Yeah, it's some like question occurred, some um, kind of a doubting, yeah, doubting occur. Exactly. Yeah, right. Because it doesn't look like a traditional school system. At right, the end right, of the day, right, 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 right. I don't have worksheets that they filled out to be able to say, oh, look what we've done today. Right, I right. I have no. There's really not record of what we've done mm -hmm. except for when you talk to the kids and mm -hmm. ask them questions about what they've learned mm -hmm. you know it's a whole different ball game and mm. they're all way ahead of grade level mm. which speaks volumes because i think just that one-on-one -on -one interaction like you can learn so much mm -hmm. in such a short period mm -hmm. of time mm -hmm. so um is there any any concern about the social activity among kids they are kind of isolated uh, from the school the social mm -hmm. group the peer group so any concern with that? no because if you think about it i don't know how the schools are in korea but in america um when do you play with your friends you wow. might get 10 minutes during recess to play the recesses are like 10 15 minutes long lunch is like 20 minutes at the most mm -hmm. and if you have a fast eater they might have five minutes to play with a friend uh -huh. so through a whole entire six and a half seven hour day there might be around kids mm -hmm. but there's very little socialization that actually takes place uh, if you really think about yeah. it but if you because if you look in a public school system kids mm -hmm. don't really have an opportunity to really play uh -huh. with their peers uh -huh. because they're sitting in the classroom and working and they're told to be quiet you know what I mean um, so what you're asking me about if they're behind yeah so I've come to find out and it could be different for other people I don't know um but for mine because of the one-on-one -on -one interaction or the one-on-three -on -three, if you will they obtain or retain a lot more information in like five or ten minutes than they do in a longer period of school at a public school so mine are actually ahead because of that, um, mm. even though just doing a little bit of it at a day, they're retaining and actually learning more mm -hmm. than they would because I'm gearing, I'm able to gear our learning towards how they learn. Mm. Um, now, you know, your child might have learning disabilities and that might not be the case and it might be really difficult to homeschool, that, which is why some people do homeschool. Um, the charter schools in the area, if you're affiliated with one, are really great at making sure that your child is not like falling behind and if they are then they'll help put things in place to oh. help your child catch up to grade level okay great so. hmm. yeah. how 
All right, huh? Is that helpful? <laughs> yeah, helpful. Do you want me to go?